Masters, and it is Panong Sat versus Victor Axelsen next. Axelsen, the current world number one and the current world champion. So Victor Axelsen, the six foot four Dane, to get us underway here in red and yellow. His opponent, Panong Sat, the Chennai Smashers. In yellow and the black shorts. It's called good. So first point for Axelsen. One of the few players to remain unbeaten this season. Chennai Smashes taking on the Bengal. Yeah. The Smashes that are very potent. Good angle and power on them. So Victor Axelson, the six foot four, eighteen, Dane to get us underway here in the table red and yellow, making some headway here tonight. Panel Sack, very funny Chennai Smashes. Yellow, the black shorts. Oh, good. So first point for Axelson. Oh, too good. Axelson just whipped at it. Axelson looks more focused this evening than he did the other night. He made hard work of his game against Wang Zhu Wei. And on sack. Lost their opening encounter against the Howard Warriors, beat the Mumbai Rockets, lost to the Delhi Dashers. One last time out against the Ahmedabad Smash Masters. Only a win will do here tonight for them. Doesn't look like it's going to happen in this game. Too good for Maxwellson again to take it to 9 4. Point perfect. Even Joel man, six foot four couldn't get to it. On the offensive again. Same result. Ten six. Well reached. Picked it up. Keeps the rally alive. There's that big smash of his that gets in the win. So another point, well, and that scoreboard ticking over very nicely at the moment. There. Then gets that opening. Quick stick smash there. One. Footwork as well in that last point. Harvest to watch. Gets himself about court. Wow. <laughs> Again, as you mentioned, the footwork just looking so easy. Going long. Shot from Talon Santa, pin his opponent back in the corner there. Okay. Yeah, wrong footed him. Right. The games that Axelson should be closing out, but at the moment, Axelson still got that buffer. Three game points in his favour. In that first game, 15-11, he comes out on top. Game two on the way. Yellow shirts and black shorts. Axelson on serve. The Bengaluru Blasters. One love up here. Love all. Point of the second game goes Axelson's way. Love. 
Oh, there's that deception again. Both of the players hit the net, oh, and this time it's Kamsa who gets the better of his opponent. Absolutely fearless badminton. They need minimum five points from this tie tonight. It is the last tie that they will be playing in the league stage. Looking to qualify for the semi-finals. Currently got three points. Their opponents, the Bengaluru Blasters, minus one point. Axelson on paper should win this game, but Tanansak not making it easy here in the second. Oh, it's gone in. No, it's called out. It's called out. Good to see Surya. Jyotika and family out here watching. By losing that first game, 15-11, Tanoksak now leads here. World number one, Victor Axelsson. This was the last point before the interval. Tanoksak scrapping for it, that flicky return from Axelsson. And then this return going out. Tried to hit the line and win the point, but called out. And it's a five-point... Before dropping it as short as he possibly could at the net. What a point. One would have never imagined such kind of domination by Tanan Sak. He is playing the current world champion, sorry, yeah. current world number one. point for their team. The Chennai Smashers here with Tanong Sak need as many points as they can tonight. They lead the tie. Yeah. Might just see the world champion change gear here. Didn't see this level of fight Two, in the first yeah. or the second game. His side in big trouble here. Minus one point for the Bengaluru Blasters this evening. Plus three points for the Chennai Smashers. They're looking to try and pick up five. What about that for a sequence of shots from Vic Axelson? That's the reply. There we go. He's That'll happy there. Power you need in your wrist to hit a shot like that. Spectacular. Just because Stan on top. Left-hander caught him on the backhand. Already is it. 4-1 down. Can't let it slip away from him. Important point. Now that was the chance. Tanon Sack putting it into the net. Whoa. <laughs> what a shot that was. Seems it's all directed in the right direction. Don't mind that. He's got to internalise it and use it somehow. Tanon Sack springs into action. 5-7, good. Race to 15. Both players involved in a similar race in their last encounters, in their last ties. Both of them taking it to the third game, both of them taking it to the last point. There we go, oh, he's missed it, has he? He's going to challenge it. So Axelson using his challenge. Now has Tanung Sak over hit this or has it landed on the line? Here we go. Oh, he's got away with it. Well, that shot did skid off the line. And what placement. Had the open court, it would have been a bummer if he missed that one. See, from that angle, the court could feasibly be out, but that f it looked in. Again, it's another one that we need to use Hawkeye for. 100% in, bang on the line. No doubt Again, it's the same response from Axelson. This time, Tanung Sat is challenging it. He thinks this was out the return. And they're big. And red. There is the final call from Hawkeye. In. Let's have a look at Axelson's point winners so far. There's the smash in blue and the drop shot that is used very effectively in this game in orange. Axelson on serve. 8 6, first to 15, wins the game and the match. 
Richardson clips the net. This smash, 317 kilometers per hour. Look at the placement on that. Put everything into it. All the games go along. Lost the first one, 11-15. Won the second one, 15-6. Down here, 8-10. And Axelson again. These returns to service are what are doing the damage. Uh-oh. now for the Bengaluru Blasters. Not over yet. Still five Nine. match points to save. Men's singles after this with Bryce Levade. And the mixed doubles after that. Still match point here. And this time he gets it. But Daxelson cruises past Tanong Sack, but it took all three games, and that was quite a fierce contest. Totally dominated in the second game, Tanong Sack. But Victor Axelson had the answers in the third. So, some big fans of Axelson in the house.